These are rig wheels, a great new multi-purpose camera wheel that you can use for a variety of different dolly and slider applications. And I want to show you just a few of the things that you can do with them. From the simplest of setups for a hobbyist or amateur, to some more complex ones that you would use on a full-scale production. First up is I have three rig wheels mounted to my CPM Film Tools DSLR Cage 3.0. Uh, you can mount rig wheels to camera rigs from just about any manufacturer using standard 15 millimeter rod gear. Uh, but here I have the wheels mounted with three bolts to this rig and I get a clean, smooth roll on any flat surface. Now another method that most of you are probably familiar with is using PVC pipe as a dolly. We're just going to turn our wheels 90 degrees and then you have a camera rig that will run on any pipe between one and an eighth inch and two inches. Here's another camera rig that I mounted rig wheels to using standard 15 millimeter rod to quarter inch adapters. Same thing, rig wheels can drop right on top. Roll on your pipe or any smooth surface. And then we're right back to our tripod. So those are just a couple options using professional support gear, but rig wheels are really easy to use for hobbyists and amateurs as well. Here's a camera rig that I built using an 8x8 piece of press board and four rig wheels, uh, one hole in the middle for your tripod head. And same thing, on any flat surface, you get a clean, smooth roll, or any pipe between one and an eighth and two inches. A friend of mine, Spencer, gave me this tip. Rig wheels will run on curtain rod, and it's actually surprisingly smooth and effective. So this is a great little camera rig for a hobbyist or amateur using materials that you probably already have in your home. You can go even simpler. I just pulled this ruler out of my drawer for this point and shoot, drilled three holes in it, and get cute little dolly moves with that too. Now let's take a look at some of the bigger dollies and sliders that we can build using rig wheels. There's three larger setups that I'm going to show you. A lot of people are familiar with this one. This is just a platform dolly on pipe. But the difference when you do this with rig wheels is, is that all you have to do is drill four holes. That's a lot easier than doing it with skater rollerblade wheels. Uh, another question that people ask me a lot is how much weight will rig wheels hold? And I wouldn't recommend doing this on a regular basis, but let's jump on board. You can use rig wheels with just about any size camera. And while we're here, since our rig already has wheels on it, let's jump it off the tripod and get a nice shot along the ground. Okay, now we're getting into some fun stuff. This is a seven foot camera slider made from rig wheels and box track. Box track is an industrial construction material and we have it available in lengths of six and eight feet on rigwheels.com. Uh, some cool stuff about this, uh, it's strong. This is steel track so you can put just about any camera out there on it. Uh, it's portable. Uh, if you're familiar with standard dolly track, this collapses the same way. You loosen up the ends and it'll fold on itself so it travels nice and easy. Uh, it's really versatile here. This camera carriage is built out of the CPM Film Tools DSLR Cage 3.0 that we saw just a little bit earlier. Uh, by configuring the slider this way, you can do some cool stuff by adding follow focus map box and other accessories. Uh, but all this additional expense and gear isn't necessary to make a slider like this. All you need is the box track, four rig wheels, and a hard piece of steel, aluminum, plastic, or wood like we have here that you can drill four holes in for the rig wheels and one hole in the center for your tripod head and you have a seven to eight foot camera slider that you can do really cool moves with. Of course the main advantages to using rig wheels to make a slider like this are cost and length. 
Uh, this is very inexpensive for an eight foot solid smooth camera slider. And at eight feet, you can get much more dramatic moves than you can with a one meter or four foot slider like it's commonplace. This stuff is very easily configurable. You can easily go from standard to low mode in just a few seconds and get some nice tracking shots along the ground. Another advantage is that rig wheels use high quality bearing wheels. So you get really nice smooth moves and stops, unlike a lot of the friction based sliders out there. Uh, another cool configuration that you can do is if you own a hi-hat, you can mount the hi-hat directly to the wood and then you can use your ball head, tripod head on this slider. Uh, works pretty slick. Here's the last setup I'm going to show you in this video. This is a 10 foot pipe slider using eight rig wheels to make up the top and bottom of this camera carriage. Uh, two important things that you need to know about using rig wheels to make something like this. One, you can use it in any angle, vertical, horizontal, slanted, any way that you can position the two pipes, you can run a carriage like this on it. Second thing is that rig wheels run on any pipe between one and an eighth inch and two inches. So what that means is you can find pipe to make a slider at just about any location that you go to. Just travel with your carriage and the ends that you use to connect your pipe to your tripod or light stands. And you can have a great little slider on the fly. A couple examples, C stands. Rig wheels will run in the bottom section of C stands, giving you about a three and a half foot move with gear that just about everybody has. Uh, speed rail, you can run rig wheels on speed rail. If you travel a lot to convention centers or hotels with meeting rooms, most of them have pipe and drape. You can use some of that pipe to make a setup similar to this. Obviously, there are a lot of possibilities for what you can do with rig wheels. We love seeing all the cool ideas that users send us. Uh, I keep a set of them with me in my backpack all the time. You never know when the opportunity for a cool shot might present itself. We have a lot more information on rigwheels.com. Check us out there. And if you like this stuff, please share, post, tweet it with your friends so that we can keep more cool stuff coming.